Lieutenant Blade, remember, our mission is to destroy that Separatist comm station. Without it, the droids can't call for reinforcements. Yes, Commander Chase, you told me earlier. <laughs> Just making sure you know. <laughs> Already, sir. Yes, Sergeant Hilt, we're ready to go. Let's have a spire down there. Pilots, pace and maneuvers. Those guns can lock onto us at any point. Sergeant, you're alive. Yes, sir. More than I can say for the others. They all dead? Not sure yet, sir. This one's alive. Good to see you made it, brother. I can't feel anything. Walk it off. Got a name, Trooper? No, Lieutenant. Never thought I'd live long enough to need one. Well, you're alive now, so you're getting one. You're the only survivor of us three, so... Three? That's your name, Three. Yes, sir. Right. We have to make it to a forward command center. Hilt? Three? Grab what you can carry. Yes, sir. Copy that, sir. What's up, Komodo? Got friendlies. What are your soldiers doing out here? The battle's over there. Our gunship crashed. We're making our way back. You're clone commandos. From what I heard, you can practically win the war yourselves. At this rate, no. Reports of several commando deaths. We were supposed to be disabling a backline cannon here. Communications are down, so we're separated from our squad. Oh. Jaw! Sniper, get down! We need to move. Stay low. How are you alive? You think the Kaminoans would give us that cheap junk you wear? We need to complete our mission. Lieutenant, HQ is not too far out. See you on the other side, men. Stay low and avoid that sniper. Sir, our scanners have detected some fighting behind enemy lines. Several officers have yet to report in. Get one of the gunships ready, Lieutenant. Yes, sir. <laughs> Sir, did you also crash? Unfortunately, Trooper. What happened? We crashed. Our men have been dislocated for the most part. My squad and I are the only survivors. Where's your sergeant, Trooper? Dead, sir. I'm Corporal Scourge, Assistant Squad Leader. Corporal, have your men get behind the tank and away from the rocks. The droids can flank them and cut them down one by one. Yes, sir. Tank is fixed. All right, blast those clackers. Ah, beautiful! I love that smell! I can see why your name's Scourge, Corporal. What can I say? I love to see stuff explode. Corporal, your squad is coming with us. Round up your men and follow us. Copy that, Lieutenant. Alright, men, let's move! We've got an enemy fuel depot coming up, sir. Three, I need a TX-130 ASAP. We're gonna blow the whole place apart. I like the sound of that blade. All right, move out, men. Uh-oh. Commander, we have clones approaching, and they have a tank. These clones are too overconfident. Engage ambush maneuvers. Roger, roger. Damn it, Commander, that was our last tank. We need to get out of here. Those tanks will tear through our platoon. Come on. Yeah, eat that, clankers. Where did that shot come from? Sir, you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. Just saw something. We're almost to the command center. Lieutenant Blade, good to see you're still alive. Commander Chase, good to be alive. Seems like you found some friends along the way. Yeah, a few stragglers. Good, we need all the help we can get. Wait, there's still men out there. Sorry Blade, we need to go now. Things have gotten bad. Blade, the company leader is dead. Too many officers lost their lives in the landings. That's horribly unfortunate. I want you to act as my temporary exo of the company, Blade. So yes, sir. That's a lot of droids. 
We need to attack them in a frontal assault. Break through and destroy the outpost. Are you sure, sir? What choice do we have, Blade? None, sir. Then this is it. Prepare to attack. Commander! Lieutenant! Is the commander dead? We need to finish his mission. Yes, sir. <laughs> Hill, tell Major Dyer that he is in command. Three, bomb the ATTs. They must advance immediately. Lieutenant, nice to see you again. I see you completed your mission. Yep, we're here to help. Thanks, we need it. We need to destroy that station. Leave it to us, Lieutenant. Sir, that clone is coming straight for us. We can easily take one clone. Blast him! and I'm in your debt, Commandos. We'll see you on the battlefront, Lieutenant. Blade. Jaw. All right, form up, Dawn Squad. Copy that, Dawn Lead. Got some news, boys. I've been made captain of Terra Company. Hilt, I spoke with Commander Dyer, and he has authorized your promotion to second lieutenant. Three, you'll be made a sergeant. Well then, this was quite a day. And the 442nd has many more battles ahead. For now, we'll wait for our next deployment. Until then, congratulations, boys. I couldn't have done it without you. We wouldn't be alive if it wasn't for you, sir. Thank you, Captain Blade. Deputy Prime Minister, you cannot remain here. Separatist shelling has already damaged the building. Nonsense, the Prime Minister and Commander-in-Chief are communicating with the Republic in the town. Damn the Republic, it'll be too late. Car will have fallen to the Separatists before they arrive. I don't... Is he alive? Then I'll report to the Eastern Section Commander. We'll fight those clankers till the last man. Our western council has fallen to the separatist artillery. Send word to the tower. Inform the Prime Minister he will be back to it immediately. Prime Minister, we are running out of options. We have received word that the western and eastern garrisons are no more. Your bodyguards are all that stand between you and the droids. Evacuation is for cowards, Commander. The Republic will come to our aid. The Republic failed to keep our planet from being invaded. What good will they do us now? The one thing we have on our side is hope. I have found hope is overrated. Hey Blade, how do you like the new armor? Well, it's lighter and more colorful. Commander Blade, this is Lieutenant Hilt reporting for duty. Ah, Hilt, good to see you. You've just reminded me. Admiral Zahn requires our presence in the briefing room. Good to see you. Congratulations on your promotion to Commander of the 442nd Blade. Your work on Geonosis must have been some accomplishment. Thank you, Admiral. Why'd you call us here? 
A serious crisis has arisen on the planet Karl. Just in the past month, the Confederacy launched a campaign to capture the planet, as it is a crucial outpost needed to mount a strike on the Republic. Due to the planet being of a more neutral nature, we had no clone troopers stationed there. Thus, we received news in the last cycle that the capital city had fallen and the Prime Minister was captured. How can my men help? I have thought it best that the assault to retake Karl be carried out in two groups. Commander Blade, you will go in one gunship and lead a company of men to assault the western fortifications, whilst Lieutenant Hilt and Major Three take a smaller force to capture the likely defended eastern perimeter and extract the Prime Minister from the tower where he is being held. Very good, Admiral. I shall prepare the gunships immediately. All right, men. Whilst Commander Blade has the support of an ATTE and more than a hundred troops on his side, we are a much smaller force, meaning we must strike fast and hard if we are to win. First, we will capture the Eastern Street, where their main fortifications are. Then we will free the Prime Minister from the tower. For the Republic! All right, Hilt. I can see ten battle droids and a commander. Let's send a rocket down there. Take out the commander and send the droids into a panic. Proceed to the tower! Prime Minister, you must understand you cannot win. I don't know who you are, but you are not with the Republic. Of course not, Prime Minister. Stop. Get your hands in the air and turn around. Sir, he's a clone. Commander Blade, we are approximately five clicks away from Lieutenant Driver's platoon. Doesn't this lumbering hunk of metal move any faster? I'm afraid not, sir. I used one to reach a droid bunker back on Geonosis. You fought on Geonosis? Indeed, Commander. Did you? Yeah. My gunship crashed, so we had to walk on foot all the way to a separatist communications outpost. Sounds... fun. It wasn't too bad. This campaign's been different, though. I despise this place. Grey skies all day, clankers everywhere, and worst off, all the casualties. This siege has gone on long enough, Captain Court. This week will be the week we end the separatist occupation of this world. Sounds like a plan, Commander. I'm in. Why would you do this? Why would you betray the Republic? Listen to me. You don't understand. I understand perfectly. And now I'll kill you myself. What the hell are you doing, Hilt? He's our brother. You can't just shoot him. He's not my brother. But if it makes you feel any better, I can put together a firing squad when we reach Commander Blade's position. Alright. But he stays alive for now. Thank you, brother. Shut up and walk, scum. Lieutenant Driver, good to see you. You too, sir. What's the situation with the siege? Sir, I'm afraid the odds are not looking good. We've been overwhelmed and it would take a miracle to turn this bed around. A miracle, you say? Well, Captain Court here had an idea. The droids are controlled by a Lukaholt battleship. That's how they function. But we destroyed the blockade so we could land our gunships on Karl. There are no ships left in the atmosphere. Which means the droids have found a way to be controlled from the surface. But where they're being controlled from, I'm not sure. I think I may be able to help. Come with me. Look here. I don't know why I should bother talking to you, but I wanted to know why you betrayed your brothers. Look. My brothers are why I betrayed the Republic. If you'd been through what I'd been through, you would have done the same. You make no sense. Why am I wasting my time here? Hey, Vess. Good to see you. You too, Kiv. How was the operation? It was... Uh, good. Yeah. Is something the matter, Kiv? Or did you just hit your head too hard in that training exercise? Listen. This sounds treasonous, but I believe the Kaminoans did something with our minds. Go on. What's wrong? Well, they left something behind after the surgery. Part of a cybernetic chip from our brain. Look here. 
that was in your head, then what's to say it couldn't be in the head of every other trooper in the Grand Army? That's what I'm worried about, Fizz. Who are you? I thought Viss was coming now. Sir, Viss died in his sleep last night. After a full scan, traces of poison were found on his body. No, that can't be possible. Security recordings have shown you were the last person with him, sir. Are you trying to say I would murder a squad mate? I'm sorry, sir, but the evidence supports that. I'm going to have to take you into custody by order of the Kaminoans. Very well. What the hell are you doing? Get off me! You don't understand. The Kaminoans have done something to us clones, and they've killed Viss. His only crime was knowing the truth. You're lying, traitor. I'm sorry, brother. Ah! What have ah. I done? Ah. I need to leave Camino. Ah. Learn more about this chip, and stop the Kaminoans once and for all. Three. When the time is right, I will tell you why I left the Republic. Whatever. Trooper, you okay? Yeah. Wow, Commander Blade. I didn't think I'd ever get to see you. Listen, we just have some questions to ask you. You were an ATT gunner, am I correct? Yeah. Far away, sir. Your injury looks pretty nasty. How'd you get there? I, uh, fired on that large building up to the north with the main cannon, only to realize it was ray shielded. The shot seemed to rebound. Why would the Separatists put a ray shield on such a random building? Unless they're protecting something. The control center. There must be it. Lieutenant Hilt, it may be wise to rest here. Night will be soon. I don't care much for the nocturnal fauna on Cal. What do you think, Three? Sure, this place is as good as any, as long as we get moving as soon as dawn breaks. I was told we should not take the Western Ridge to reach Blade, as it is too heavily fortified. Who told you that, Hilt? The deal is, you don't talk. The Prime Minister himself told me this information. And how does the Prime Minister know this? The tower is on the Eastern Ridge almost a hundred clicks away from the western one. What are you trying to say? Why do you think I tried to kill the Prime Minister? Because you're a murdering dog! I am afraid you are wrong, Lieutenant. What do you mean? Your traitorous brother was here trying to save your lives by killing me, but thankfully you saved mine first. So I am afraid you will be coming with me now. Bloody clankers. Hilt. Three. Wake up. You. Look, you have to- I forgive you, brother. What? I shouldn't have mistrusted you. You were right about the Prime Minister. He was a traitor the whole time. Would have been great if you'd realised that before we got captured. No one's coming for us now. We still have hope. You don't plan on actually going into their stronghold alone? Not alone, Lieutenant. Court here will accompany me. You must stay here with the men and keep their droids distracted. I don't like the sound of this, sir. We have no other choice. Clowns, isn't the high strike here? I am. What the hell are you doing? They're gonna kill you. I thought that was what you wanted, Hilt. No. No, I don't. I'm the highest rank. Very good. Follow me. General Wren, I have captured the clones as you wished. Excellent work, Prime Minister. With those clones as hostage, the Republic will be bound to surrender. Sir, just a few low-ranking clones won't force them to give in. The Republic is far too compassionate. That is their fatal flaw. Believe me, Prime Minister, they will surrender. Do you know Ren? He was the clown you requested. And I suppose you're the guy in charge? 
Indeed. I'm Vakren, and you are? Lieutenant Hilt of the 442nd Siege Battalion. Now, if you don't mind me asking, why'd you bring me here? When you arrived, we confiscated this off you. Any idea what it is? It's Commander Blade's homing beacon. He's coming to rescue us. You failed, General. On the contrary, Hilt, the fool has come to shut down our droid army as I expected. How could you know that? When your pathetic commander arrives, our droids will be waiting. Your men will surrender. You seppies are smarter than you look. Minister, take some droids and execute the remaining clone prisoners. No, you can't do this. I'm afraid I can, Lieutenant. There's too many droids around there, sir. We must find another way. Look, a vent. It should take us straight to the center of the base. Good idea, sir. Clones! General Wren has ordered your execution. You seppies are such cowards. You would seriously kill a prisoner of war? Yes, indeed we would. I meant to ask, why would you betray all your people and join with the Clankers? It is quite simple, really. The Separatists promised me a high rank in their alliance. You piece of bender. I do not have time with this. Droids, proceed with the execution. Roger, Roger. Commander Blade. Three, you're still alive. Nice job. Only just, sir. Wait, where's Hilt? They took him to the central control sector. Hurry. You, take us to the control center. Well, Hilt, it seems your usefulness is over. Any last words? I've got some, General. What? You're supposed to be captured! So it would seem. Now, General, you will deactivate your droids, or your Prime Minister dies. I think it would be best if you complied, General. Sir, they're almost on top of us. Come on, Blade. It's over, boys. Been good serving with you. They did it! We've won! I owe you my thanks, sir. Don't thank me. If it wasn't for Hilt, we might all be dead today. Well, that's most kind of you, sir. Lieutenant Hilt, you are being promoted to Arc Lieutenant of the 442nd. Commander Blade, Arc Trooper Hilt, there has been a prison breakout on Coruscant. Your immediate assistance is required. The cruiser is in range for us to contact the Republic. Contact the Republic. Tell them you are launching a shuttle down to pick up supplies. Over. This is Admiral Jarn of the Venator Draconia. My ship is in need of minor repairs and needs to launch a pickup shuttle to Coruscant. Admiral Jarn, you are clear to launch the shuttle. The plan is working perfectly. Now you must get to the shuttle. Remember who is in command here, Admiral. You will come with us. They will doubtless check the ship has a life form on board. Very well. I will accompany you. The shuttle has landed in Hangar C. I guess we have to search it. Let's head over there. Remember, they will send clones to search the ship. See to it you dispatch of them. That will not be a problem. Admiral Jaren, I didn't expect to see you here. I came down to show you everything is in order on this shuttle. You may return to your duties. I'm sorry, sir, but we have direct orders from the Jedi to search all shuttles landing on Coruscant. Very well, then. Head to the coordinates we have been given. The General is held very securely. Commander Blade, it is good to finally meet you. Where is the prisoner, Vak Ren? 
We sent him down on a separate shuttle, General. I assure you, he's securely confined elsewhere on Coruscant. I see. Meanwhile, a member of the Geonosian High Command has escaped. That sounds highly unlikely, unless they had help from the inside. You mean someone in the Republic helped them to escape? I can't be sure. I suggest we head to the prison immediately. Yes, sir. Escort the prisoner to cell 4. Yes, sir. Commander Blade, General Ren is secured. Excellent news, Hilt. Everything running smoothly so far? Yes, sir. He has given us no trouble. I suggest you stay for a few more hours. I'll contact you when I have more intel on this breakout. Blade out. So these, Commander, are the prison logs, security footage, access files. Everything you need is here. Very good. I'd like to see everyone who's accessed the cell before the escape. Here, Commander, it seems we have a Republic Admiral by the name of Jaren. Inside help, as I suspected. Where can I find this Admiral? Well, it was today, in fact, a shuttle from his Venator, the Draconia, landed on Coruscant. I must contact my Lieutenant, Hilt. Then we should head straight to the shuttle site. Hilt, someone has entered the prison compound with unauthorized access codes. Stop there, clone! Commando droids, open fire! Ah. Commando droids have broken into cell 4. We're on our way. You okay, Hilt? Ah. Hilt! I will finish the job. There is no time. He has contacted the Republic. We must extract General Ren quickly. General Ren, good to see you. And you, Admiral. I presume you are here to rescue me. I want my payment first. That can be arranged. Now let me out. I said I want my payment first. Good. That fool only stood in our way. Vikrin. So, this was all an elaborate distraction just so you could escape. Indeed it was, Commander Blade. Now if you don't mind, I shall be leaving now. Send as many men after him as possible. I'll check on Hilt. Commander, did you get him? I'm sorry, brother. We're still pursuing the general. Listen, you can't let him get away. I know. We'll catch him, I'm sure. Commander, I apologize for my failure, but the general has escaped the planet. We can't win every time, trooper. Assemble the men. I'm not giving up on recapturing the general. Hey, Commander. Good to see you again. And you three. Court, what's the report on the status of Carl? The remaining Separatist holdouts have been destroyed and the Prime Minister has been imprisoned. Excellent job, all of you. Just wish I could say the same for myself. What do you mean, sir? Vec Ren escaped Republic custody. And Hilt? What happened to Hilt? He's in critical condition and has been placed in a Bector tank for recovery. We have to recapture General Ren, sir. Well, that's the problem, Three. In order to pursue the General, we need direct permission from the Chancellor. We must escape the Coruscant system as quickly as possible. General, I suggest we abandon this Republic cruiser once we reach the base on Anos. An excellent idea. Prepare the cruiser to jump to light speed. Pilot, set the coordinates to the Anos system. Roger, roger. Um, sir, I've made a slight calculation error. Then where are we? The, uh, Hoth system? I am sorry, sir, the Chancellor is occupied. Get an executed his report on the Republic's history, Christophsis. Chancellor, Christophsis is secure. General Lowe, sub commander of the Separatist forces, has been captured. Very good, Captain Rex. Chancellor, Commander Blade wishes to speak to you, urgently. Show him in. Chancellor, 
It's an honor to make your acquaintance. What can I do for you, Commander? As you may know, Supreme Chancellor, General Vec Rin of the CIS has escaped Coruscant. And you would be willing to track him down and bring him to justice? If you would give me permission, we could... Permission granted, Commander. How many Venators would you need? I'm sure only two would meet our needs. Good, good. You may leave when you are ready, Commander. I wish you the best of luck searching for that separatist filth. I must keep an eye on this Commander. I sense great potential in him. Potential that could assist my final plan. What did the Chancellor say? He seemed all for my plan. We are commissioned with two Venators to carry out the assault. Well, that's good, because I found the location of General Ren. That quickly? How? Well, all Venators have a tracking beacon on. Considering the General stole one, we've tracked the Draconia to the Hoth system. This is most fortunate. Get the ships ready as quick as possible, Court. Let's catch the General. Commander Blade, the opposing Venator has opened fire, but our shields are holding. That must be him. Let's try out those prototype V-Wing fighters the Chancellor gave us. They will be bound to surrender if they take enough damage. Exactly, Admiral. Sergeant Falcon, prepare your squadron. Destroy the enemy. Right away, Admiral. All right, boys. Into your fighters. I'm looking forward to trying these out. Me too. Hey, squad. Cut the chatter. We got a battle to win. You are my naval commander. Destroy those ships however you please. As you wish, General. Watch the vulture droids. Roger, roger. Enemy vulture droids incoming. Admiral Zahn, we need fighter support. Commander Blade, what is the status of the ARC 170s? Admiral, I'm afraid they're not fit to fly. After the naval battle on Carl, they took quite a beating. Over! Sergeant Falcon, pull back immediately! Your fighters are being torn apart by the enemy! I hate to admit you're right, Admiral. All remaining V-Wings, fall back! Sir, we could do this! Keep pushing! Fall back, pilot! You're gonna get yourself killed! Ah! Sir, fighters are retreating! Very good. You will await the Republic's next move. I was hoping it wouldn't have to come to this, but we're gonna have to board them. Are you mad? Their fighters will tear you apart. Possibly, Admiral, but we will not retreat now. Court, you three, and driver, take one gunship with as many men as possible, and I'll take the other. I cannot say I approve this plan, Commander, but you are my superior. With only two gunships, the enemy will have less of a target to aim for. At least the enemy ship batteries won't be able to hit us. Very well, Commander. I hope this works. Court, take your men to the main hangar. Copy that, Commander Blade. May the Force be with you. And with you, Captain. Pilot, full power to the engines. Commander, what are you doing? The droids will all attack me, not you. You will be able to get into the hangar unnoticed. Commander, don't do this. Trust me, Court. It's for the Republic. Blade! How's he doing? Well, the pilots managed to pull up just enough so that the crash wasn't as bad. Commander Blade will be alright, but he needs to get out of the cold first. Hang on. Splinter, give me the box. I see something. Looks like an abandoned base. Base? Who would build a base here? Well, it's isolated. No one would think to look here. And whoever does would freeze to death. Speaking of freezing to death, we better go now. I can't feel my hands. Sir, don't try to get up. The crash might have fractured a few bones. Yeah, and I have over 200 more to get me moving. We have to get somewhere before we all freeze out here. There's an abandoned base about 90 feet away, sir. Good. Phantom, Splinter, grab what you can carry. Doc, help me up.
Ultimately, we'll pay for the death of Blade. I'm going to destroy each droid on that ship until we reach Vec Ren. Cool it, Corp. Need I remind you that our orders are to capture Vec Ren and not eliminate him? Oh yeah, and look how well that worked. Captain, please, just try to relax. Save it, Driver. You couldn't even catch Ren. It's your fault we're here, and it's your fault Blade is dead. Hey, enough! Court, this is no one's fault. We did our best to keep Vec Ren from escaping, and now we're here to ensure he gets captured and returned to Coruscant. Major Three, you are currently the highest ranking officer in the battalion, making you our acting commanding officer. What are your orders, sir? We capture Vec Ren, we destroy the droids, and we get off. Sounds like fun. I'll take Vec Ren. Not happening, Court. For all we know, you'll probably just shoot him and pretend it was an accident. Anyone else getting creeped out? Uh, it's just dark. And cold. Please don't say the word cold ever again. It isn't much, but we have light now, and it's warmer. Sir, the communicator can't get a signal in this blizzard. Hopefully the antenna will boost the signal. Ugh, this helmet is bucking me. Let me get it off. Something wrong, sir? We've got an enemy fuel depot coming up, sir. Three, I need a TX-130 ASAP. We're gonna blow the whole place apart. I like the sound of that blade. All right, move out, men. Uh-oh. Commander, we have clones approaching, and they have a tank. These clones are too overconfident. Engage ambush maneuvers. Roger, roger. Damn it, Commander, that was our last tank. We need to get out of here. Those tanks will tear through our platoon. Come on. Yeah! Eat that, Clikers! Where did that shot come from? Sorry, Phantom. I got distracted. Although, after we get out of here, I need to ask you something. On the bright side, sir, the communications are up and running. Nice work, Phantom. Get those connected and tell the 442nd we need to get off this planet. Sir, several clones have entered the pier. Several spots have broken off from the main force. They must be trying to secure the ship, which means they will be coming here. You stay here. You four with me. Alright men, time to split up. Sergeant Scorch, your squad will take the reactor. Lock it down and stay there. Copy that, Major. Sergeant Cutter and Lieutenant Arrow, you two take the bridges. Cutter on auxiliary, Arrow on main. So yes, sir. Colt, driver, you take the escape pods. Got it, three. All right, men. Go, go, go! Major, the reactor is clear. All droids have been destroyed. Good luck, Sergeant. See you on the other side. Let's see who can clear their bridge first. Arrow, how you doing? Bridge is clear. But Vec Red's not here. What? Where is he? Does anyone have a location on him? Negative, Major. Red better hope he doesn't run into court, and I hope the same. I can't believe I got stuck with guarding the pods. Court, will you ever stop complaining? Oh, no you don't. How does it feel, Captain? To lose your commander? How will it feel to take revenge? It'll be my pleasure. Uh, g give me a minute. I I'll patch you up. Don't... Don't bother, driver. I'm not getting out of here alive. Shut up. You're getting off this ship. Driver... I I'm sorry. Cord? Cord! Stay with me, Cord! Don't... Don't do this to me. What the? Hey, Ice, come here. Sergeant, they're detonators. They're going to blow up the ship. 
Three, the droids have the reactor rigged to blow. Get everyone off this ship, now! Colt, do you copy? Sir, Colt's gone. How? Vec Red. He got away. Get to the gunship. Pilot, punch it! All droids meet at my position. We will set up at the abandoned base on the planet. Driver, I'm sorry, sir. I had the chance to kill him, to kill Red, but I hesitated. And that got Court killed. I should have sent Court to get Red. We failed. Sometimes failure can't be avoided, but we need to find Vec Red. And this time, no holding back. We're killing him. For Blade and for Court. I want to do it. I want to be the one to blast him. By all means, you can. Are we almost ready? I think so. We can send the beacon and we can contact the Venator. Alright, send out the call. Anyone there? This is Commander Blade. Does anyone copy? Blade? Three, is that you? Blade! We thought you were dead! Don't worry, I'm fine. What's the status of the Venator and Vec Red? Sir, the Venator was a trap. It was destroyed. Vec Red escaped, and we lost course. Don't move, Commander. Due to Doku's absence, I will be leading this session to discuss the proposed build for a new droid founder in Akiva. As Senator for Akiva, I represent the people's demands for protection, and that is what this factory will give them. I call upon the Senator from Sertak. With my respects to the Senator from Akiva, he does not seem to understand that he sits here to represent his people. It has been made clear his people do not want anything to do with this droid factory. War has come to this galaxy, Senator, and it takes true separatists like me to stand up to the Republic, not bargain with them like your pathetic peace party. I stand by the Senator from Sev Talk in his bid to oppose the motion of the creation of the droid factory on Akiva. The Geonosians saw their world mercilessly occupied by the Republic with the use of military force. I ask any senator here, would you enjoy watching clones pour through the streets of your cities? Quiet, quiet. We shall put this to the vote, all in favor of the bill for a new sec factory of Akiva, say aye. 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 All in opposition, say nay. 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 The motion is passed. A new droid foundry will be built on Akiva within the coming months. The Senate infuriates me. Those hypocrites accuse the Republic of warmongering, but they'll gladly partake in building droids that will kill thousands. As much as I am willing to support you, I understand the Senator from Akiva's concerns. You might as well join the military if fighting means so much to you. Now you mention it, I have been pondering the idea for several weeks. You can't be serious, Ren. Trust me, you should stick with politics. It's what you're good at. I suppose you're right. Well, we best be getting back, it's after dark. Hilt, how you doing, brother? I'm fine now, Three. I am sorry about Core, Arrow told me. Don't worry, Hilt. We will soon bring Vec Ren to justice. Exactly, Driver. We should probably head to the briefing room. Admiral Zahn might have some information on Blade's location. Before you go, don't get your hopes up about Blade. We heard him, Hilt. Through the comms. He's alive and I know it. Look, you know what I'm saying, Driver. Just keep it together. Alright, Zahn, what have you got for us? Three, you should probably see this. I'm sorry. I wish I could have been there instead. We never saw him shot, Hilt. He isn't dead. Drava, I know it's hard to accept, but Blade is gone. Just get the troops ready. Ready for what, Driver? We're not going to get Ren. He killed Court and now he's killed Blade. Do you want to see the rest of the company dead as well?
We set out to capture Ren. Now Blade has to be rescued. If we turn back, Court will be dead for nothing, and Blade will be a Separatist prisoner. Separatist prisoner? He's dead, Hilt. He's bloody dead. Driver, listen to Hilt. He's speaking sense. I don't want anyone else at this company killed on a hopeless mission. Three, you're a traitor. If you want to change your minds, I'll be in my quarters. Ren, stop! What are you doing? Honoring an old friend, you worthless clone. Since Carl, I have waited for this moment, Commander. Blade! Blade! Phantom, thank goodness you're not dead. Ugh, at least get a light on in here. Since we are stuck here for who knows how long, I might as well speak. You're a murderer, Ren. Shut your mouth. I believe I kill for the right cause, but so do you, Commander. You've killed before just because you believe your cause is benevolent. Just say what you want. I don't care. Who are those guys? A Republic sympathizer. The intelligence will have got in touch with them. The two senators should be coming down the street. Nama, so what do you think of the Parliament? Just trust me. Politics isn't for me. It seems Ren thinks the same. It was just a thought, Anvas. Trust me. It's getting dark. We need to get to the apartment. Damn it, Fizz. The sniper's jammed. Just get out of here. The droid police will be here any second. You're right. Come on. Father! Anvas, come on, get up! Narmer, we need to get out of the street. I've only been with you, father, for a few months, but he wouldn't want us to stay. I don't care, Ren. My father fought for peace. Peace brings us nothing when this Republic is determined on killing the innocent. You're right, Narmer. Tomorrow I will speak to Dooku about a position for myself in the military. You mean a position for both of us, Ren? If that's what you want, Narmer, I can see why you would. Driver, look, listen three, I overreacted. You were right. Thanks for being on our side, Driver. We need you now more than ever. Yeah, stay here, we can talk more. Let me get some rations. Driver, open this door, now! If you two won't help the commander, then I will. Driver, you'll be court-martialed for this. Unlock this door! Everything all right, sir? Y yes, of course. Hey, Arrow. Hilton 3 went to tell the other Venator about our plans of attack. Attack? But I thought they changed their minds. Attack the last of the droids. Yes, sir. ATT will be coming up on our position any time. That's the last of them. Where's Blade? Hold on, driver. There are three life signs over there. I will never forgive you for what you did, Ren. But at least now you begin to make sense. I never thought I would hear that from a cloak. I suspect the others will kill you at first chance. But for now, you will answer for your crimes in a Republic call. I should never have been a soldier. At least, I can suffer the fate of a traitorous politician. Commander, what are you doing? Maybe Anvas was right. Peace isn't completely out of the question. Commander, what is Red doing? Driver, stop! He's unarmed! Driver, you just gunned him down. He tried to kill you, Commander. What did you expect? Sergeant Driver, I accuse you of the unprovoked murder of an unarmed prisoner. You are under arrest. Driver, how are you holding up? Fine, Hilt. Any news on where my trial will be? Driver, you know Senator Rex Weir, don't you? Rex Weir? Yeah, before I joined the 442nd, I escorted him on a diplomatic mission to Alderaan. Why do you ask? He says you're the only one he trusts. Trust to do what, Three? What happened? Who are you? 
the Anti-Republic Action League. You're going to help us, Senator. We're ready to send a transmission to the Republic. All right, speak only when you're told to, Senator. The transmission has begun. Republic, you know who we are. We have Senator Rex Swear as a hostage. Send down a diplomatic team and we will be willing to negotiate the conditions for his release. Now speak, Senator. I would appreciate it if you could send Clone Trooper Driver. He is the one that I trust. No tricks on the Senator dies. You have one cycle. I hope you will cooperate. We won't kill him, Tarek. We will do what is necessary. If that means he has to die, then we will shoot him. Well, Driver, what do you think? The Senator needs our help. We have to go down there. Get our strike team ready. Let's show these terrorists not to mess with us again. Steady on, Hilt. They'll just kill the Senator if we do that. Not if we're quick. We can't take that risk. Commander, what do you think? We don't have any diplomats and it'll be too late if we wait for one. Unfortunately, Hilt is right. We have to send in a strike team. Commander, Three and I will stay here in case the Republic contacts us. Alright, Driver, you will come with me onto the surface of a loft with a small squad. After everything, you're letting me go? No, Driver. But if the Senator trusts you, then so do I. What do you see, Commander? There are several terrorists on that landing platform. They were expecting us to land there. We'll have to take them all out if we want to get inside. All right, but we have to be as quick as possible and make sure none of them escape. We can't risk them telling the leaders. All right, squad, move out. The boss said they should be here by now. I don't like this, go tell Tara. Stay behind, driver. Come on. Fire in the hole! Are you sure that was a good idea? Come to think of it, probably not. Alright, stay here. What was that? They might have double-crossed us, Tarek. Then the Senator dies. Wait. At least give them a few more minutes. That's all they get. Then he dies. In the name of the Galactic Republic, you are under arrest. Commander Blade, you've made a grave mistake coming here. Now the Senator dies. Stop! No! Kiv? What are you doing here? I'm sorry, Blade. You know I hate the Republic for what they did to me. But I couldn't let the Senator die. Well, I guess we should arrest you. Driver, they'll try to execute you back on Coruscant. Join me. You don't have to serve this Republic anymore. Driver, think about what you're doing. We've given you everything. No, Blade, Kiv is right. After everything that's happened, I don't belong with the Republic anymore. I will have to take you both into custody by force. I don't want to do that. You don't have to, Blade. Say Driver was killed in the raid and no one else would have to know. Just go. Make sure I never see you again. Take this. They'll think I was killed. Senator Rexwear, get up. We need to leave. Commander? What happened? They knocked you out, but I killed them. Let's go. There's a ship on the landing pad. Today we honor the Fallen. Captain Court, and most recently Lieutenant Driver. If the time comes, every clone here must do the same. For the Republic! Sector is clear. Come 
Armada, get off! The Republic has retreated. You have done well, General. I trust Hypori will be safe in your hands. Yes, Lord Dooku. Guess the 212 need us to do their job for them. Kata, this place isn't a joke after everything that happened here. You mean the first battle? The Seppis took out five Jedi generals and an army of cloud troopers. Only Captain Fordo himself got the survivors away from General Grievous. You know, there are times when you think the Jedi are unkillable. Apparently they can be if they don't expect to be beaten. Ah, Commander Blade. It's good to see you. What's the situation, Commander? Take a look over there. Welcome to Hypori, gentlemen. Hey, Ice. Bet this could do some damage, huh? You and a rocket launcher do not work well together for one reason. You'll probably kill one of us with the back blast. You have no faith in me, Ice. No faith. I do. Just not when you have an explosive device in your hands. Gotta agree with Ice on this one, Scourge. Phantom, have you seen Captain Hilt? Oh yeah, he was helping three get stuff off the gunships. Alright, when he's done, have him report to the command center. Yes, Commander. You sent your hostage buddy after me? I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. Anyway, Cody found that airbase in the hills. I want you to lead a company and destroy the fighters there. You sure a company can handle that, sir? You're one of my best men, Hilt. And to tell you the truth, one of the best leaders in this battalion. If anyone can lead this attack, it's you. Yes, sir. I'll have my men ready to move out. Captain, there's a few droids down there. We'll draw them out to minimize casualties. Good idea. Group 1, draw the droids fire. Group 2, with me. Work, boys. Now let's finish off those droids. Hold on, sir. I think we missed a ship. That's definitely not a vulture droid. I think we need to leave. Now! Open fire! Run away, clone! You might be a coward, General, but I'm not. You should have run! <coughs> Sir, hundreds more droids are about to converge in our position. They've just come out of the base. This was a trap. Fall back! Phantom, any idea what happened? It was a massacre. There were no survivors, thanks to General Grievous. Commander, I'm afraid now that we've failed to take the airbase, the High Command won't let us continue the campaign much longer. This is all my fault, Cody. Look, you were in a hard situation, and you did what you thought was right. Hilt, you're gonna be okay, brother. Don't worry. No, I ain't, Commander. I got a bloody lightsaber shoved through my gut. Shouldn't have sent you out, Hilt. Don't worry, Commander. I'm gonna see court and driver. Just like you said, in the time comes, every clone must die. For the Republic. Well, Commander, what did the High Command say? No need to call me that anymore. What do you mean, sir? After I pori, I've been relieved as commander of the 442nd. I will serve as a captain in another company. They can't do this. Not after everything we've all been through. Orders are orders. And besides, I'm sure my replacement will treat you all well. May I have a word, Blade? Look, Three, I understand if you hate me. Hilt was your closest friend. He told me when he died, that he would die serving his Republic, and that nothing would change that, no matter how it happened. Thank you, Three. I'm going to miss fighting alongside you. Well, goodbye, Blade. Best luck, Arrow. Goodbye, Commander. Several failed battles killed much of your original battalion, only for you to receive multiple promotions within a few months. Commander Blade, your military career has been mediocre at best, and insufferable at worst. 
You are not fit for command over the 442nd. I would have made Major 3 the commander, but he has opted to step down as Major of the Battalion. You and 3 will be leading your own companies. Your replacement will arrive from Kamino in the coming days. That is all, Captain. What the hell, 3? Why did you step down? I was not going to stay a battalion exec without you. Plus, the Republic was far too generous in issuing my promotions. At least you'll be in command of your own unit again. You're a far better leader than I am. No, Blade. I'm coming with you until you're reassigned. You're ruining your chances of... Don't argue, brother. I've already had my request accepted. You're stuck with me now. You're loyal three. I'll give you that. But I'll be glad of some company. From what I'm hearing, the Republic is taking this war to the next level. We have to be ready to face the future.